Australian construction, you know, stick frame, standard construction, nothing um, difficult. We're going to install an air tightness layer. So what we're going to do, uh, we're going to install uh, the Intelli membrane. The Intelli membrane has two major functions. One says it's actually creating an air tightness layer. So as part of the system, we have tapes and grommets and sealants and uh, individual boxes around uh, power plugs and light switches, which we're going to demonstrate later. The key thing of the membrane is that this is actually installed on the internal side of the framing. So of course, we would have normally bulk insulation installed, and this is installed, and on top of that, we then have our internal lining, normally our plaster board. The way we start off is we install membrane with a slight um, overhang at the bottom, so we already mark here our height on that one. And, uh, the installation is fairly straightforward. The only tool you really need is a knife and a stapler. So we start off with uh, working our way around. I'm going to show the bottom edge as well, so that helps with the installation. In a field, we uh, make sure we staple the top line first, and then we go into the centre, and then from the centre down. Normally, we staple about 10 uh, centimetres or 100 mil apart. And the best way is just going to staple it is the length of the staple. Just go down. What is very important is that if we have um, plates for light switches or power plugs that we also then make sure that we mark them so we know where to find them later on because once we have the membrane installed it's often difficult to find them. So now that we've um, installed the internal air tightness and moisture control there on the inside of the framing we want to make sure that we continue or create a continuous air tightness layer and that means that where we go from the wall to the subfloor construction, uh, we want to make sure that the connection here is also done airtight. The way we do this is um, if we have smooth surfaces, we can use um, these high performance tapes. The advantage of um, these high performance tapes uh, is that um, they can be applied to cold and damp surfaces, because often in construction we find that uh, you have a slight moisture film. Um, on the surfaces of mem especially on membranes and there's a lot of tapes especially bitumous based uh, tapes that don't actually stick to uh, membranes so so we have one person um, holding the tape and, just on the one. and the other person just laying it out and uh, we try to push the membrane back and uh, just apply pressure. Uh, try not to pull too hard on the tape because if you pull too hard you actually pull the membrane also over. So basically one person is just peeling off the backing, the other person is just running along and installing the meters.